Okay, this is the 10 random questions tag. Hang on a minute. I know beverages are important in this booktube culture, so let me have a shot of this. Strange taste in tea. Not like it was brewed in the Rockies. Mm. On to the questions. Uh, ten random questions, steak. Number one, favorite meal? Steak. Either porterhouse or T-bone. Uh, preferably with the blood running out of it. All I need is that. Some Tabasco sauce and a knife and a fork. Don't even need any sides. And we're there. Question number two, favorite song? I'm assuming that's something current so I'm gonna go with Rihanna love on the brain question number three one butt to bite who's it gonna be well that would be my wives because I say wives I meant my wife's um, you don't stay in love with someone for 30 some years without liking that booty uh, question number four what movie would you choose to exist in um, that would be Hard Times with uh, James Coburn and Charles Bronson, and it was about bare knuckle fighting. And uh, <clears throat> in that movie, if you needed to put food on the table, make a little money, it was all about fisticuffs. So you'd have to go back to some of my previous uh, videos to find out what that's all about. Um, <clears throat> question number five Your president, what do you ban? stupidity. Uh, if you have a learning disability, I'll excuse you, but if you're dumb just for the sake of being dumb with the internet and all the books and the free going to the public library and whatever, then that's on you. Don't be stupid. Number six, Sorcerer Stone or Excalibur? Excalibur, because I'm all about hands-on. Uh, your death, who do you bump off? That's question number seven. That would be the dude or dudette that came up with Skynet that wiped us all out and allowed the Terminators to do their thing. Question number eight. <clears throat> what indie book deserves worldwide acclaim? Easy. That would be my novel... Gray Sun and the Colored Rain, which is about a, it's about life in a uh, segregated coal camp uh, around 1912, and it was a bit of a microcosm, a melting pot of uh, black people, white people, foreign folks, and they were all, sh you know, shoved together in these coal camps, and uh, actually your home was painted according to where you belong, so that saying, uh, on the other side of the tracks, or the wrong side of the tracks, very fitting for this. Uh, yeah, um, I wrote this. Uh, it was two years of my life, well spent. Um, I've written seven or eight novels. I don't know, I'm losing track. But I would stick a match to all of them, all the other ones, to save this one here, because I'm, it's it's the novel I'm the most proud of. So. I may publish it someday, don't know. Question number nine. What's a hidden talent you have? Hang on. Hidden talent, I'm an expert marksman. Or at least back in 1984. When I went through basic and AIT, I was, uh, you know, 36 out of 40 targets, some of them 300 meters out. Whew, I sure was something back then. Probably couldn't hit anything now. I don't know if I could handle a rifle. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Question number 10. You can resurrect one person. Who would you bring back? 
Well, I watched some other videos on this, and uh, you know, you don't want to bring back family members because that wouldn't be fair. So, I'm going to go with uh, Jim Morrison and Jimi Hendrix. Why? I don't know. I think it'd be cool to sit down and drink, I don't know, a couple hundred beers with those dudes and maybe smoke a little. You know, not real big on the smoke, but. Uh, Hey, I'd party with those guys, man. Jim Morrison's from my favorite group, The Doors. Jimi Hendrix, my favorite guitarist. There you go. So that ends the uh, random book tag thingy. And uh, I will uh, see you ladies and gentlemen later. Bye.